okay i'm not playing in today's video i'm connecting the shell esp 32c3 board to arduino iot cloud to measure humidity and uh, temperature so i'm using i guess what d h t 22 sensor or am 2302 sensor output of the sensor the data pin i attach to gpio 2 of the board and uh, the ground minus of the sensor i connect to ground pin of the shear esp 32 c board in the plus which is the VCC is attached to pin 3.3 volt. Now I connect the board to my laptop so we can upload the sketch from Arduino IoT Cloud. So we jump right into Arduino IoT Cloud. So that's the thing that uh, that uh, I created DHT22 sensor and uh, I click on it so we can see what we might find. So uh, that's my variable, two variables I have created. So the, the first one is the humidity, it's a floating point number and the name is h u m okay declaration float okay um uh, i save it and the second one is the temperature okay um temperature that's the name and uh, uh, it, it's also a, a floating point number okay guys uh, so we save it then you go to sketch uh, we go to sketch uh, no first uh, first of all that's my the type of my board okay i connected the, my board to arduino iot cloud okay and you provide your wi-fi name and your password and uh, the secret key please i've already made tons of video about the about arduino iot cloud okay guys you can search on, on my playlist okay. you need to Go download to and the dht so. sensor library here the dht sensor library so that's the gpio uh, okay the gpio on which the sensor is connected and of course as I as I mentioned before earlier you you need to download this library okay uh, so yeah that the GPIO and uh, the type of the of uh, sensor DHT and to 222 and uh, here uh, okay we are uh, yeah and uh, here you, we have the um, we created a, an object okay called DHT I think okay so here I call I called uh, these two functions okay I don't know if I need if I need it I don't know if I uh, yeah but, but I I did that. so I did those I called uh, these two functions so they can print out the values of the 
humidity and temperature okay the the following variables are automatically generated by blah 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 blah, blah. okay uh, so that's the function for temperature okay uh, the uh, this function will read the temperature and the, this one the humidity now go to dashboard and you create a dashboard i've already done that uh, i'm going to show you my dashboard so that's the humidity and the, the widget for humidity i'm going to show you the widget for humidity is uh, you scroll down and you're gonna see it okay percentage okay is the widget of humidity okay and you are i linked uh the variable humidity h u m to the widget i think we don't need this icon uh, okay uh, because yeah i don't need it that's temperature we are measuring measuring humidity now uh that one is the widget of temperature what i made a mistake here the temperature is not in percentage uh, please don't make uh, this kind of error mistake okay okay so now you go back to thing and you download and you upload the the sketch from there so you open the full editor and you search for your board shiao esp32 and uh, yeah it's fine uh, I, I'm going to provide uh, the the sketch, okay, guys. And uh, I think also uh, I think that uh, this sketch works fine also with uh, normal ESP thirty two board. Okay, so you don't need to worry to worry uh, about that. So we are uploading the sketch. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Uh, I think it's the sketch is good testing time okay folks that's our project if you click on iot remote app from your mobile phone you're gonna see that dashboards and uh, that's my project the ht22 sensor now you click on that and you're gonna see the widget the humidity and the temperature the humidity is um 17.5 and uh, the temperature 17.8 uh, okay i can heat uh the sensor you're gonna see the changes okay guys as you can see okay the humidity will decrease because it's getting hot but it, it it's it's increasing i don't know but it will decrease okay it will decrease 
and uh, the temperature will increase the humidity decreases because I think no water and that uh, and the temperature will increase because of what because I'm heating the sensor uh, that's it thank you so much bye bye